So this is the hundredth launch uh, from Sri Harikota. And uh, of the GSLV version, this is the seventeenth launch. Now this launch is primarily to launch a satellite which weighs approximately 2,250 kilograms. And um, this is uh, to, to, uh, to have our own navigation system. As you know that without a GPS you don't have a, a launch uh, mission. So we want to create our own uh, navigation system so that we don't depend upon somebody else uh, on this matter. So we are in the process of launching satellites which will be primarily used by the uh, defense agencies. Of course, it's a restricted use. It doesn't mean that we can't use it. We can also use it. Maybe once we perfect the system, we can also use it. But if we have one small difficulty. We are having this exclusively for the region. It is for the country, whole country, it can be useful. And uh, also about 1,600 kilometers outside the border. It is not a global system. If you want to have the global system, then you should have, I don't know, maybe about 20 satellites, something like that. But it is possible. We can achieve that. But as I told you, everything uh, depends on the money content. Everywhere you, you need to spend money. Space business is not cheap. It's an expensive uh, project and ISRO is very cautious in, um, in spending money at the same time in clubbing many uh, goals together and then try to take uh, very, very calculated risks uh, so that we continue to remain as the lowest cost uh, and the performance which is reliable, repeatable, consistency, everything is there. So this is what we are trying to do. Actually, uh, all these experiments are towards the Gaganyan we are planning for the year 2028, including the docking experiment which we had some one week back. So all these things are prelude for the Gaganyan project. And once that is achieved, then we will be in par with uh, many of the space uh, exploring countries in the world.